Hallelujah. Hey everyone, this is Brandy and I'm back to read the word of God with you. I'm going to read Psalm 7. Glory be to God. I will do live in translation. I pray all is doing well this afternoon, this beautiful day. Glory to God. I pray that God is blessing you and keeping you. Hallelujah. Keeping you encouraged. Keeping you in the faith. Keeping you in expect expectancy from him. He's doing a wonderful thing. He's doing marvelous things. We got to believe it. We believe that, oh God. We believe that today. Hallelujah. That you're doing a wonderful work in us. Thank you, God. Hallelujah for perfecting those things that concern our lives. We thank you for that. Hallelujah. That is God's plan for our life. He thinks of good thoughts about us. Yes. Hallelujah. Good thoughts he has for us. How to prosper us. Give us a future. Not evil thoughts. Hallelujah. Give us a future and an expected end. He has a glorious plan for our lives. Lord, let us align up with your plan. Let us line up with your will. Let us line up with what you have uh, hallelujah, in store for us. Let us align. Hey, hallelujah. With the spirit of the living God. Yes, let us seek you first, oh God. Let us seek the kingdom of God first. Hallelujah. And let everything else be added unto us that we need. Hallelujah. Let us not worry. Glory to God about things, hallelujah, that we cannot control. Father God, and I thank you. I thank you for that. I thank you for that, that spirit right there, that, not to have to worry about the things that are out of our control. Glory to God. In Jesus' name, I pray uh, that the, the, the Lord is blessing you. And, and we, I pray that this word enriches you and encourages you to keep fighting, keep for, uh, 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 fighting for the belief fighting for the contending for the faith that was once delivered unto the saints contend for your faith contend for it contend glory to god don't stop hallelujah seeking faith don't stop believing god contend for that faith glory to god it says in psalm 7 verse 1 it says i come yeah i come to perf to uh, uh, to you for protection O lord Again, verse 1, I come to you for protection, O Lord, my God. Lord God, we come to you in the name of Jesus Christ for protection. Save us, O God, from our persecutors. Yes, rescue us. Glory be to God. Verse 2, it says, if you do not, yes, they will maul us like a lion. They will maul us down like a lion, tearing Hallelujah, tearing us to pieces with no, with no one to rescue us. This is glory to God. Hallelujah, have your way, Holy Spirit. What God is saying here, oh God, if we don't call upon him, if we don't desire him, there are things that come about that try to tear us down, that try to maul us down. Glory to God, when, when people persecute you, when things are, are spoken ill of you, this is what he's talking about here. Glory to God, they come to persecute you. They, they, we need a rescue. They try to tear you down. There are people that will try to tear you down. And we know that it's not necessarily them. Hallelujah. But then it is them. There are some people that do allow the enemy to use them. And they're, they're fine with it. But then there's some that do not. And there's, there's a spirit behind it. And a lot of times they don't even know they're doing it, you guys. Hallelujah. I, I, I come to recognize that some of those that that are not willfully giving themselves over to Satan. They don't know that the, that, that the enemy is using them to, to uh, uh, tear down a Christian or tear down those that believe in Christ Jesus, tear down the sons and, 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 and uh, daughters of God. They don't even know the enemy is using them. They, don't even, they have no clue. Hallelujah. But there are some that do. But those that uh, we're, we're praying for them, that, 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 that God will, will release them from that tormenting demon that, that, that has them trying to tear down somebody else. We, they need, we, those people need freedom. They need deliverance from that. Glory to God. And we asking God to, to for those that don't know that they're being used, that, 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 they, uh, that God exposes them to what is actually going on, what they're actually doing to the people of God. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. It says, rescue me. Verse 3 says, Oh my God, for if I have done wrong, or if I'm guilty of injustice, if I have, have betrayed a friend, if I've done these things, or plundered my enemy without cause, 
then let my enemy capture me. Then let them do pretty much let them do what they're doing. If I've done this thing, how if I've done this thing to these to, to these people or to you know to the circumstance, let it let it have run its course. Let it be let it you know. He's saying David is saying, well, let, let me go through it then. Uh uh. And it says in verse uh, five, then let the enemy capture me, let them trample me into the ground and drag my honor in the dust. If I've wronged somebody, God, he's he pretty much said, if I've done, if I've wronged these people like they say I have, hallelujah, then 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 okay, I I, I can accept what's coming, right? I can accept it because I, I I dished it out, so I, so I should be able to take it. That's what this this text is saying. And it says in verse in verse five, he says, "Arise, O Lord, in anger, stand up against the fury of my enemies. Hallelujah! Wake up, my God, and bring justice. Gather the nations before you, rule over them. Hallelujah! From on high, the Lord judges the nations. Yes, God is a just judge. Hallelujah! Declare me righteous, O Lord. Declare me right." Well, hallelujah, my, my right standing here, Father. So now he's saying that he did not do those things. But he was saying earlier, if I did it, then I have to accept it. But now he's saying to the Lord, Lord, I this is this is this now that you've judged the situation, now that you've you've come in and I've I've assessed my own self, Father God, I am in right standing with you. I'm I I'm 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 doing the right thing here. Hallelujah. Declare me righteous, O Lord. For I am innocent. Oh, most high God, I am innocent. Hallelujah. I heard the Lord say, plead your case to him. Hallelujah. Stop pleading it to everybody else. Glory to God. Plead your case to you. To him, you are innocent. Glory to God. Hallelujah. You did not cause these people, hallelujah, to come against you. They just wanted to. Plead your case to God. You are innocent in his eyes. You are innocent. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When you're innocent to him, he has the power to make you innocent in other areas. Glory to God. If you didn't do this thing, you are innocent in his, in his place. You're in right standing with him. So plead your case to him. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Verse 9. In the evil of those who are wicked. Hallelujah. And defend the righteous. Glory to God. Do you understand this thing? Put an end to the God is saying, when you plead your case to him, he will put an end to the wicked lies to the hallelujah, to the wickedness that's being done unto you. But you gotta come to him. Stop going to everybody else. Stop going to friends and family. They don't have the power. Hallelujah. To defend you. They don't have the power to give you the right to put you in right standing with God. He has the power to put you in right standing with everybody. Hallelujah. For you look deep within. What do you do? He looked deep within the mind and the heart. Jesus looks deep within the mind and the heart. Oh, righteous God, it says here. He looks deep. He sees it. He sees your case. He sees where you're innocent. He sees where, hallelujah, the wickedness, hallelujah, of the enemy has been lying against you. He's been plotting against you. He sees it. Plead your case to the Father. Verse 10, it says, God is my shield. When you plead your case, he can be a shield for you. When you plead your case to him, you can be that shield, saving those whose hearts are true. And right before you, God, listen at this thing. God is an honest judge. That means he's fair. He's truthful. He's trustworthy. He's faithful. Hallelujah. And he stands for what is right and what is true. Hallelujah. He don't teeter-totter. Nothing can make him waver on the truth. Nothing can make him change the truth. Nothing can make him change what is right. Glory to God. He's an honest judge. He is angry with the wicked every day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because they think they're getting away with something. They think they, they, that they slick and sly. Glory to God. Hallelujah. But they're not. God sees it all. He, he, he looks deep within the heart and the mind of men. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Yes, he's so good. It says in verse 12, it says, If a person does not repent, God will sharpen his sword. Oh, God. Hallelujah. He will bend. 
Hallelujah. And uh, and to string his arrow. Or his bow. I'm sorry. He will string his bow. Glory to God. God going in. Hallelujah. The battle. He wants your spirit. He wants your soul. God is, he's, he's, he, he desires to save your soul. Hallelujah. He was willing to fight for you. He's willing to fight for your soul. He's willing, hallelujah, to sharpen his sword for you. He's willing to come after the enemy for you. Plead your case to God. Hallelujah. He's a right judge. He's a true judge. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Yay. He will prepare his deadly weapons. He's fighting now. He's fighting and shoot his hallelujah flaming arrows. God will fight for your case. Glory to God. God will fight for you. He knows the truth. Glory to God. But he needs you to tell him. To remind him of that truth. He already knows it. That's why he, deep, he searches deep within the heart and the minds of, uh, of his people. He knows the truth before. He knows the end before the beginning. He knows the truth already. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But if you're not asking for nothing, how, how does he know to give you anything? Hallelujah. Glory to God. He wants to hear you speak to him. Hallelujah. Moses, talk to the rock. Don't strike it. Talk to the rock. Hallelujah. Moses, hallelujah, speak to the rock and I will give you water. Hallelujah. Come on. Glory to God. God is my shield saving. Hallelujah. Those, God is my shield saving those whose hearts are true and right. God is a honest judge. His anger, his anger is with the uh, wicked every day. Hallelujah. Verse, uh, verse 14, it says, the wicked conceive evil. Hallelujah. They are pregnant with trouble and give birth to lies. These people are being used by the enemy to do this stuff, you guys. There are people like that. We just pray for them. We ask God to heal them. But God is willing to stand up for you in this. He's willing to stand up and fight against the enemy that's, hallelujah, using these people. Hallelujah. He ain't fighting against the people. He's fighting that enemy behind this, that, that thing. Glory to God. Hallelujah. They dig a deep, uh-huh. They dig a deep pit to trap others. There are some, I'm telling you guys. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I know about that, that trap. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They dig a deep, uh, dig a deep pit to trap others, then fall into it themselves. Oh God, oh God, the trouble they make for others, it backfires on them. <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory to God. It backfires, guys. Keep trusting God. Keep believing God. But plead your case to God. The violence they plan falls on their own heads. I will thank the Lord because he is just. Let's thank God because he's just. I will sing praise to the name of the Lord, most high. Oh, yes. Sing unto the Lord a new song. You don't even have to, you don't have to know how to sing. You don't have to have a, 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 a wonderful voice to sing unto the Lord a new song. He receives it. Glory to God. You, I, I'm on here singing all the time. I know I don't have the best, the best of the best of voices. But hallelujah, I don't mind praising my God. Hallelujah. Yes, verse 16 and the last one, it says, the trouble they make for others backfires on them. Listen at that thing. The violence that, that they plan falls on their own heads. Hallelujah. It does not feel good going through that. It does not feel good, you guys. But trust God. Plead your case to God. When these things come, when you, I'm telling you, what it, may, it mainly happens in the workforce. Hallelujah. When dealing with people uh, uh, in close quarters a lot of times. You have these type of situations. Hallelujah. When the enemy gets on, on people and start manipulating atmospheres in, in your workplaces. And people in your workplaces. And family structures. Or maybe even a ministry structure. Organizational structures. However, he gets on his people and start operating in them. They don't even know. But if you plead your case to God. 
and expect him to fight for you. Because it says here you're gonna put on his you're gonna put on his war clothes, put on his sharpen his his, his his weapon, his weaponry, and get after that that uh that enemy. Not the physical part, I'm talking about the spiritual man, the spiritual part of the of the uh of the enemy that 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 manipulates people into doing things that they sometimes don't even know they're doing. So we just pray for them, oh God. We pray for those people that allow the enemy to, to, to manipulate them and, and use them and, and put up false false things about you in, the, in, their, in their mind. People are jealous. Some people are jealous of other people because the enemy told them to be jealous of them. A person ain't did nothing to them. We just showed up. <laughs> and they're jealous. They just, who knows what it, what's going on with them. But we just pray for them. Pray for them. God is wanting us to pray, you know, and, and 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 love on them. And we do that. We do that. That was Psalm seven. Glory to God. Psalm seven, uh, one through, uh, verse one through sixteen. Maybe seventeen, right here. Let me see. That's seventeen. One through seventeen. I'm gonna come back and read eight. I pray everybody's doing well this day. Bless the Lord. Get saved. Give your life over to him. Be born again. Being born again means having his spirit man, his spirit, the Father God's spirit living on the inside of you. Hallelujah. Something about the spirit man. I have said it about three times by mistake. God wants our spirit man strengthened and mature in him. Glory to God. Hallelujah. The flesh and the spirit are fighting each other daily. But if our spirit man is strong and anchored in Christ, we can defeat that flesh. With our spirit man can defeat the flesh that's trying to get us to be in, in, within enmity to God. When we're carnal, when we're worldly, when we want the things of the world, that we're in, we're at war with God. So if we build our spirit man up, glory to God, the things of this world will not will not draw on us. The lust of the eye, the pride of life, the lust of, of flesh, it wouldn't draw on us, right? So God is saying something about the spirit man. He wants our spirit man aligned and in tuned with his spirit. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, I bless the Lord for you guys today. I bless the Lord. Hallelujah. That he's calling on you. That he's calling you to come back to him. I bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Because he sees your soul. Hallelujah. He makes your soul alive. Yes. And he gives you favor. Yes. He makes your soul alive. Yeah, God. Hallelujah. And he wants to build your spirit, man. Hallelujah. But first you got to have his spirit. Hallelujah. So he can build on you, teach you, and, and comfort you, and help you, restore you. Yes. And all it takes is sub submission. All it takes is humility. Humble. Be lowly before God. Respect him as the God that he is, that the king that he is. Hallelujah. He is a king. Hallelujah. And he wants to respect. Oh, God, let me get up off of here. God, he wants to respect the awe. He wants you to be in awe of him. He wants you to respect him, reverence him. Glory to God. In Jesus' name, I pray for y'all. Bless God today. Bless him for your salvation. Thank him for your salvation. In Jesus' name, amen.